All right, all my farmers and friends, how are y'all doing today? It's your host, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, today we're on Farming Simulator 19, as always, almost. Um, I done got, as you can see, one, two, three, four loads in the pit, and here is the fifth one. We're doing, I ain't quite full, but I gave sheep some grass. Let's, let's do that real quick. As you can see, sheep are good, pigs are good, chickens kind of low, um, goats pumping, um, need some TMR rations for the cows, and we don't have no horses. But, I've been turning my speed down to a three mile an hour, then hitting the, the uh, cruise button. I've just been coming in here. I did take the skid steer and push some of this back at the front. Um, been getting this this off of our fields. Uh, field one was one trailer. Field two was another trailer. Almost, not quite. But I went to field six and done out outside edges and stuff. Got it working and stuff. You know, just been in there cutting grass, mowing grass, and whatever you want to call it. And then that's all I do. And then I'll just turn my speed back up. As you can see, the bottom right down there, what I was doing. And, uh, yeah, to show y'all our crops, I, I mowed around the whole field, mowed around this side of the field. And my neighbors decide to start playing some music if y'all can hear that. So, uh, yeah. Uh, I do have this field left. Uh, to do and field three and of course five ain't been in five either um i think i got all that's in field six let me stop here for a second and see if we can do that we need to finalize these anyway collect and collect uh, no loan yet yeah, i'm thinking about taking out a loan getting some things folks uh, as you can see, field three needs to be fertilized, but I'm going to wait after I plant corn in it to do that. Um, and the uh, pH balance looks like that. And I uh, hear a siren. I didn't get paid for nothing. But anyway, as you can see, that's, the green is grown and the blue is cultivated. And uh, we got, just in case you are new, we got potatoes and fill four and part of five. One and two is wheat, six is canola. Uh, the other half of six is going to be beans, and then what's left of five is going to be beans, soybeans. And fill three is going to be all corn. I do want to take y'all somewhere. Uh, Hang on a second, I'll be right back. All right, I've been trying to stay out of the field when I do this, but as you can see, we got the grass right there getting picked up with the loader wagon, and I've been mowing. Uh, I want to come over here and show y'all something. We got that log trailer just sitting there, folks, at the farm shop. And I want to clean up some of this, and uh, we need more money. Um, it takes money to to make money, right? That's what some of them says. All right, I'm gonna stop right here. We're gonna shut everything off. God, oh, this thing's got green stains all over it from mowing. Uh, on the map, you can see where I'm at. I'm gonna go to this. We own field three. We own field three. Uh, we're gonna go to this little pickaxe or hammerhead type field um, they're wanting 49 for it and we got 29,000 um, yeah I'm thinking seriously about getting that we can take out a little small loan we'll make the money back pretty fast uh, matter of fact there's probably some more missions in here transporting see there's that right there so before this episode's over with, we might do that. Um, yeah, I want to 
do some more mowing off screen and or, yeah off screen and I will bring y'all back and uh, we'll buy that and see if we can cut down some wood and we sell some wood um, yeah we just got to get that revenue up there because we're gonna have to have a combine here pretty soon so yeah but anyway uh, I hope y'all stick around for the rest of the video and hope it's worthwhile for y'all and uh, folks I just want to say I thank you right off the bat you know, I love every one of y'all and thank you for oh I'm gonna have to come back and get that bush I can't leave that bush here I'm trying to clean this up but I love y'all and I thank you all for what y'all do for me so please hang around if you're interested and uh I'm gonna be right back I'm gonna get a couple more loads and the pit and um, do a couple of uh, contracts off screen if I can get some pop up. I got that one to do. So, uh, yeah, I'll be right back. Folks, I have turned my GPS on so I can keep a straight line. That way I don't have to worry about hitting the walls or anything. And I can just come in here and dump. i using this track. Oh, I got use the skid steer kind of level it out. Oh, GPS off. That's why I'm going crooked. Oh, come on. I messed up that time. That's my fault. But I used the skid steer to kind of level it out there for a little bit. And I just locked my GPS on and I kind of go over a little fast, a little bumpy. But with the weight of the loader wagon and stuff, as you can see, it's. 41% compacted. That should have been 42. And this thing kind of levels it out as I go. I almost get 2% each time I cross. Probably shouldn't be going this fast, but hey, it's kind of fun in a way. At least I ain't getting stuck. I am going to have to use a skid steer to push up the ends there a little bit. But now I'm going to go mow some more. And another load. But folks, this is probably going to be a little short episode. I just want to show you filling this. Um, the videos might be kind of scarce a little bit. Um simply because a uh, bunch of stuff that's going on drop that there and drop that there if I can get on it a um, couple updates in my life um, I haven't really been around her but I did get the medical call on uh, my cousin and she, she's got COVID you know she's, she's a lot older than me too and she already had uh, some health issues, but um, this going in, you know, it was, it's rough because she got it and then her husband got it. And uh, I think the other, her, her sons uh, tested negative, so that's good, but. Um, but yeah, she's, she's not doing too well right now. And also plus, you know, my, uh, and, you know, we got to do what we got to do. And, uh, between that and me, my mom and dad, my son and daughter all went yesterday, which was September 11th. We went to our Walmart and got our COVID-19 shots. Um, so far, no bad side effects or anything. Um, when me and my daughter kind of experienced like a little lag after about 30 minutes to I was like this ugh feeling. And then all of a sudden, whoa. Y'all see that? I don't know what that come from. But anyway, um, 
after about an hour or so after we was feeling the the we got a serious increase of energy and I'm like I know exactly what's going to happen when this stops we're going to crash so hard but no we, we, we didn't we didn't crash that hard uh, I did get sleepy took about an hour and a half nap woke up a little drunky but about I don't know hour or two later I was feeling back normal and uh, this is the next day this is a 12th I'm recording this and as you can see you know I'm a little slowish as far as moving and stuff with my muscles uh, but I'm pretty much normal the uh, where the shot was given at is tender uh, I brush up against her, I raise my arm a certain height, and then I can tell, oh, hey, yeah, that's where I got the shot at. So, um, that happened, um, but as far as mom's arm, a little bit sore, uh, but as far as kid, my son's arm's uh, really sore, but my daughter, <laughs> she got it. I, I, I might answer it here in a here in this video, I don't know. If I do, it'll be right here. Yeah, I think she went, ouchie, ouchie. But she had like one tear, but other than that, that was it. Usually she balls when she gets a shot. But she took it pretty good. So all my family is vaccinated, or, you know, that lives here in the house with me. Uh, so, yeah, um, got 28, 27 days, or 27 now counting today. And, uh, we go back and get our second shot. And, yeah, I, uh, me, mom and dad got the one that started with the M. And then, uh, the kids had to get the one, uh, visor. Or phaser phaser or visor I don't know it wasn't a Johnson Johnson shot but it was uh, another one um, so uh, that's that on that part you know and, and when I watch water I go about three times a day that's about maybe five miles away uh, and uh, it, sometimes they don't it just it only takes about 30 minutes to really do that job. So about an hour and a half a day, 30 minutes each time I go. And um, I'm pretty much done. And uh, so that's why I'm going to try to get some of these videos recorded for y'all so you at least have a little bit of something. Oh, this is taking longer than I thought. I should have kept the trailer on. Let me look back up to that trailer. It might help a little bit more. I don't know. But anyway, um, so y'all should be seeing this on uh, Monday. If I can get it recorded or edited in time, I'm recording it now. So, but, um, it's just the editing. Shouldn't be too much to edit to it. One or two skips that I did. Um, Actually, I, yeah, I guess the trailer would work better when I had it loaded. Still about two, like one and a half to two percent each time I, I go. But I want to make sure I get this compacted before I put too much more in it. I really don't have that much to mow. Probably about three more loads I think I'm going to go inside the sheep pen and the cows pen and try to get some of that grass and um, uh, I want to buy that field but I don't think it's going to happen this time um, as you can see I got times 15 it's really nothing we can do uh, today except for grass 
Uh, oh, hey, we got a weeding contract. I'll take it. We got any more? I do have that mod we can refresh. Uh, we'll take that weeding contract. Um, I want to go in here one more time. Um, this field here. Um, as you can see now, I'm up to 30,000. So we need 19, maybe 20 more thousand to go. Um, I do have a gold bar to sell, but I don't really want to sell it right now. Um, so yeah, uh, but in a day or two, this will be pretty much ready to sell. But tomorrow we should be able to sell the, uh, or not sell, but plant the soybeans and corn. Because that's what I was wanting to show you. Uh, get back over here. See our, our soybeans and corn right here, these two. Is this the first day of it and the temp has not changed? It needs to go white. So I'm going to give it till tomorrow. And that should be white, and that way, you know, we we will know we ain't taking no chances of it not uh, sprouting up and stuff. So, yeah, I got this almost 95. I'm gonna stop it right there, folks. I'm gonna do the rest of it off screen. Do have to come over here. I got 89% death. So uh, let's go ahead and fill that up, minus six dollars. We're going to get some fuel and then we're going to end the video. Let me turn my GPS off before I have a boo-boo. Uh, but yeah, check out my camera light, uh, my can crusher. I seriously need to make a video on these two. Um, and if you're new, hit the red button, become a member. $267 in fuel. We, we still above 30000 so that's good. Uh, let's see. Uh, check out the other YouTubers and stuff down there. And before I go, I was in Osceola Walmart yesterday, and I met this young man, and he's a music musician. He does music. I can't say that word right, but he does music, and, and um, he's pretty awesome, man. He's pretty awesome. So it was nice meeting you if you're watching this video. I did say I was going to give you a shout out. So uh, I do not have the stuff here in front of me, and I am so sorry, but I'm going to put his page up right here. Now I'm going to try to have his stuff down in the description, folks. So be sure, and other YouTubers are down there too. So be sure and go check them out. Send them some love. Tell them I sent you. Um, so we all got to support each other, folks. Um, and to all the new ones that has joined my channel, way I do the support and stuff is you watch my video leave a comment and I'll watch your video and I'll leave a comment on yours that way we'll go back and forth but anyway uh, I got this field here mowed around oh I just missed my turn as you can see right here I was mowing this area around on top of the hill there and after we do our harvest I want to come in here and level that ridge out there uh, just so we can and kind of square or fill up a little bit and have some grass to cut there. But I'm going to park this here because I'm fixing to have to go and check the water at, at the next town. So, uh, but anyway, y'all go check everybody out down below. Check the, the, the links, uh, Facebook, Instagram, stuff like that, mine. And uh, if you do, what? Well, like you go to Instagram, just say, hey, Tommy, how you doing? I, I know you join, uh, you know, join Instagram and stuff. 
And uh, if you got a Facebook or an Instagram you want me to check out and, and, and you know, hit the follow button on, uh, uh, jump on Facebook and send me a, a private message on there and uh, with your link and stuff. I don't like putting links in the, the comments down below because they go to my spam and I, I don't check my spam like I used to. I, I check my spam or, or non-filtered comments, whatever they're called. I, I check them like every two to three weeks. So uh, just uh, jump on Facebook and send me a message. And I'll, I'll follow your Facebook or Instagram or whatever. And uh, folks, but anyway, I, I, I got to get off here. It's probably rambling to you. But anyway, uh, when we come back, the pit will be full and covered. And we will be planting soybeans and corn. And uh, as you can see right here where I've been going around mowing up here. There's where potatoes stop at. And... I do still have my drill, my planting drill. I just forgot I put it over here. So, yeah, we're going to be planting beans over here and some beans there and then corn and field three in the next video, folks. Hopefully, if everything goes right. So, I love each and every one of y'all. Thank you for your time and th thank you for all you do on my channel. Don't forget, Farmer Simulator 22 is coming in November the 22nd. So if you want to donate or or, or whatever, if, if, if you're feeling generous, y'all can do that. If not, you know, just whatever. I'll find a way to get it somehow or another. But uh, with y'all's help, it'll just be soon. Anyway, I am jumping for joy, folks, because Farmer Simulator 22 is going to be awesome. Um, go check out Dagrin and DJ Goham and, and Peen. I don't know if Peanut's done anything on it, but quite a few others. Mr. Silly P. They all do some awesome uh, detailed explaining the, the things that's in Farming Simulator 22. But anyway, folks, I love y'all. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.